When the surface of your feed troughs become rough and eroded, Concrete is the best material to use for repairing and resurfacing them. The first step is to check the surface temperature of the trough using a thermometer. Air temp and surface temp are not the same thing. The concrete temperature can be much different than the air temperature. Don't apply Concrete if the surface temp is below 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Surfaces over 90 degrees may cause Concrete to harden extremely fast. Materials needed for applying Concrete include concrete trowels of various sizes, knee pads, a grout sponge for surface finishing, a five gallon bucket with water for cleaning trowels, a thick nap paint roller, a roller tray for KB25. Before installing Concrete, the surface must be properly prepared. Please watch our video on how to use Vanberg's Concrete Clean and Etch to prepare concrete for repairs and protective coating. Before applying Concrete to the trough, the surface of the trough should be primed with KB25 liquid. The KB25 can be applied using a roller. For areas that can't be covered with a paint roller, use a paintbrush to apply KB25. The KB25 acts as a bonding agent to make sure that the Concorite gets good adhesion to the concrete. For larger areas or high volume repairs, the KB25 can be applied with a pump sprayer and then spread with a long nap roller. For detailed instructions on mixing Concorite, see our video on how to mix Concorite Rapid Set High Strength Repair Mortar. After mixing the Concorite, use a trowel to scoop the mixed Concorite from the bucket and place it in the repair zone. Use a steel concrete trowel to spread the Concorite over the repair area. Follow the circular shape of the trough with the trowel working from the edge down to the bottom of the trough and back up to the other side. Check the depth of the Concorite on the surface. We recommend a thickness of about a quarter inch or more for deeper repairs. Concorite sets quickly in most conditions, so trowels should be cleaned frequently. After placing the Concorite, wait a few minutes for it to firm up before final troweling. As the Concorite begins to harden, the trowel will slide more easily over the material without sticking. Since the Concorite hardens quickly, don't mix more material than you can use in 15 minutes. As the Concorite begins to harden, make additional passes with the trowel to smooth and finish it. You may want to use a round end trowel to eliminate ridges and trowel marks. After about 15 minutes, use a damp but not dripping wet grout sponge to finish smoothing the surface of the trough. Your trough repair is now complete.